several seniors from North Dakota State's championship football team are preparing to take their shot at the next level at Pro Day next month. While some will travel the country to train, Darius Shepard has found his facility of choice right here in Fargo. Valley News Live Sports Director Beth Houle has his story. After five years in Fargo, former Bison wide receiver Darius Shepard has decided to stick around a little longer. So after the championship game, I went home for a little bit, and then I came up to the Power Center to uh, talk to Randy and Brett about training here. Shepard was referred to Sanford Power in Fargo by Ryan Smith. The fellow former Bison great went on to have a successful career in the Canadian Football League, thanks in part to his experience with the staff at Sanford Power. Told me that we're going to work, and these guys do a great job pushing me each and every day. Something that I appreciated at NDSU with Coach Kramer is getting pushed. Preparation for pro day is different than your typical training session may be for an athlete. But the staff's experience preparing for the test NFL scouts will run has them focusing on the details with Shepard. We need to talk about the, the, the fine tuning of exactly what each test entails from where your hand, your foot placement, um, changing of directions. Do an incredible job with, with all the details, I think. You know, speed work, mechanics, and just getting stronger for football and being more explosive. They essentially rehearse these tests each time they're in the gym. When testing day comes, there are no unknowns. Darius will know exactly how fast he can run, how high he can jump, how far he can jump, and how strong he is. Those results aren't the focus today, though. Right now, Shepard is expected to focus on improving every day and taking care of his body. His trainers are handling the big picture. March will be here before we know it, and uh, it's my job to make sure that when he steps up, he's ready to showcase the scouts what he can do. Hopefully turning those five years in Fargo into his next football venture. In Fargo, Beth Wool, Valley News Live Sports. Now we are tracking several former Bison who will be participating at North Dakota State's Pro Day in March. Beth Hool will also be in Indianapolis at the beginning of March for the NFL Combine, where former Bison quarterback Easton Stick will be showcasing his skills.